Another mistake I've made in public speaking, and I think this uh, is very uncomfortable for people listening to us, I have spoken from my open wounds rather than spoken from my healed over scars. And what I mean is speaking about something that was hurting me or upsetting me or was painful in me or making me angry or frustrated or vengeful or bitter um, and some suffering I was going through and I spoke about it too soon. So what they got was not just the story um, or the information or the occurrence, but they got my negativity, my anger, my bitterness, my ranting, my attacking someone, um, my judgment, uh, my judgmental attitude, because I spoke about it too soon. And I think um, what I'm advocating that we do is wait. Wait until your open wounds heal or you'll bleed over us all and nobody likes that. Wait until it's healed over and become a scar and you've figured things out and you've learned and grown from it. That's the version we want to hear. That's the talk we want. That's the book we want to read. That's the podcast or the TED talk or the sermon. Wait until your cry for help has become an act of service to the rest of us. And sometimes that's difficult to calculate. Sometimes you think you're through it and you're not and you start telling a story, you get emotional, get teary, and you kind of know it's still a bit near the surface from it's still a bit raw. I think it's that, and there's nothing wrong with that if it's done well. But I've made the mistake too many times of um, speaking from those wounds. Don't do that. Speak to us from your scars. That's the version we want to hear of what it is you want to pass on to us.